Well done, you're at lesson six. This is where we talk about book publishing and getting your book on Amazon. In this lesson, we're going to have a series of short videos that will cover the topic of publishing. The very first lesson, the one that we're in right now, we're just gonna do a quick overview of the Amazon dashboard so you can get familiar and you can get set up and then we'll go through step-by-step step together to be able to create the book listing. So the first thing you need to do is go to kdp.amazon.com and sign up and create a new account. Once you've signed up, you'll arrive on your dashboard. This is an image of the KDP landing page and then you'll sign in. And the next section that you'll go to is your dashboard. You will see these four links at the top, bookshelf reports, community and marketing, and you'll be using this all the time. The most frequently used one is bookshelf. You click on bookshelf and then you'll press the yellow button plus create. Now creating your book listing and publishing your book is super, super easy. I will walk through this with you so you can see exactly what you need to do, but just all you need to do, the most thing, most important thing first is create your KDP account and then second, end up on this page. Once you click the plus create button, the next section it will ask you is, what would you like to create? What type of book, Kindle, paperback, hardcover or series? First, start with your Kindle because it'll be the quickest one and we'll upload that. And what you'll wanna do is upload it and view it, see how it looks, pay for it, buy it as a retail customer, get it delivered to your device and just check everything. Make sure you're happy. Once you're happy with that, then go ahead with the paperback and do the same. The paperback may take two to three days for Amazon to review and approve it. And literally the information for both listings is identical. So once you've done the first one, the second one is literally a copy and paste. In the um, course under the resources section, there is a template there for the book listing. I, what I would recommend you you do is you take some time before you come online to publish and just write out a bit of detail about what you're thinking of including because it can be a bit nerve-wracking feeling like you're on the spot you've got a short amount of time to fill in the form on Amazon to publish your book so definitely use that book listing template that's provided for your use and then simply follow the steps once your book is published, you may come back a bit later and decide you want to change some of the information or modifying it. And Amazon makes it really easy for you to update your book. There are four different things that you can update. You can update your book details. That's the information in your book. There are certain things that will be locked. Um, but you always go back to your bookshelf and go from there and Amazon will let you know what you can and can't do. You can update your manuscript in case you've made any significant changes. You can update your cover, you can unpublish and delete books. Very straightforward. In this course throughout, I've peppered and sprinkled lots of links to the Amazon help desk, more so the Amazon tutorials on what you can do. I provide good information, but the links that I'm also providing will give you the most up-to-date, including any changes from Amazon. So together you've got really great resources. Amazon will pay you for all the books that are sold on the website. They will take the cost out of the gross sales price and they will pay you a percentage of the profits depending on what program you go on. Within this course, scroll down and read through the different programs for the royalties. They call a payment a royalty. Um, it depends on the strategy as to what price you're putting your book at. If you're most just interested in selling lots of book in, books and making an income, you're going to probably increase the price of the paperback and keep the ebook low. But if your goal is not necessarily about making money from the book, but getting a high volume of, of sales so you can get people coming into your world and getting to know you, you might like to keep the book price down a bit lower. We cover that in detail. Um, Amazon has an extremely good value competitive pricing model for their book printing and delivery and their Kindle delivery, as well as all the publishing and, and all the administration that goes with it. So you will make some quite good profits on some books, 35 to 70%, 60%, but in the course itself, you will find the information that you need. In the next few videos, I'll go through, I'll break down each of the steps in detail as you can look over my shoulder while we create a book listing and publish your very first book. If you'd like to try doing this yourself and you haven't got the book ready yet, 
you can use the sample book that's provided in the resources. That's the very last resource number 12 to play around and have a go at it with me. Okay, let's have a go and do that next.